Hello, snowboarders of the internet. I'm your host, Averin Lefebvre, and in this video, we're gonna be reviewing the Now Select Binding. I rode this binding at Arapahoe Basin with typical spring-like conditions. You had blue to gray skies with clouds, warm temps, slush, chop, chunder, ice, kind of just a mix of everything. Then I rode it on my Ride Shadow Band snowboard with my K2 Thraxxus boots. All right, so much like other Now bindings, you have limited adjustability on this. You have twist cams on the toe and the heel. So you unscrew them, slide the strap forward or backwards, center it over the boot. The high back, you have your forward lean tab, pop it up, slide it down, slide it up, flip it back up, lock it in. And then you have the ability to swap out the bushings underfoot to whatever durometer you want. That's it. Very meat and potatoes over here. So when it comes to the straps, I'm not going to lie to you. That toe strap is questionable at best. It's not great. It's not bad. It's just sort of there. It does need to stretch a little bit right out the box. It is rubber inside the cutout and there are grip pads on it, so it will stay locked down. But with the offset cutout, it'll fit a pointy toed boot better than a snub nose or a blunted shape boot. With the heel strap, it is that one piece design. It is a little more rigid. This means that your boot is gonna provide all your padding. This is just there to lock you down. You do have the hinge on the inside, so that's gonna give you a little lateral play in there. Overall, it's not a bad strap. It gives you power where you need it, but there's play where you want it. With the ratchets, you got that one finger quick release. It works. They climb well for the most part. They're easy to feed in. My biggest gripe is that on the toe ratchet, you don't have that one finger quick release tab. So you're grabbing it from the front. That takes a little more torque. There is a little bit of play in the buckle as well. So you'll probably notice that I wouldn't worry about it. I didn't have any issues with it. These never actually prematurely released. They did what they needed to do. And that's what you want out of a ratchet. With the high back, you have a ton of play in there. You can really feel that give, especially when you're tweaking or playing around in it. What is nice is you do kind of have a center spine, which will let you drive into it somewhat and get some response. And then you've got that forward lean adjustment where you pop the tab, slide it up, slide it down, flip it down, lock it in, and you're good to go. This is a softer flexing binding. It's not quite a full blown jib noodle, but it's not middle of the road. You do get response toe to heel. And with the skate tech on these bindings, you end up losing a little bit of lateral play. They have a bigger disc, they're a little more rigid, but the straps kind of compensate for that. So you do have a little lateral roll in there, which is nice for when you're jibbing, buttering, playing around. Overall, like I said, it's not the stiffest binding out there. It's not the softest, but it is below middle of the road. This is a bit more of a lively binding. You have okay dampening underfoot, which means it'll dissipate a lot of that micro chatter, but anything more aggressive, you are gonna feel that in the bottom of your foot, through your ankle, knees, and hips. Nothing wrong with that, just be aware of it. This is binding for the park-focused all-mountain rider. So overall, for what it is, it's not a bad binding. It's softer than the Select Pro, which is nice. It lets you have a little more lateral tweak, which is something that I find lacking in a lot of now bindings. This kind of compensates for it. That toe strap, questionable at best. Not a big fan of it, but it does work. Overall, it's not a bad binding. Comparable bindings, the Rome Vice, the Union Ultra, the Nitro Zero. This has been my review of the Now Select binding. Do you agree? Do you disagree? Do you own a pair? Are you going to buy a pair? Leave me a comment down below. Let's have a conversation about this binding. If you're new here, remember to subscribe, click the bell, get those notifications. That way you're not missing any of the videos we got coming out for all you snowboarders of the internet. And if you really like what we're doing over here and you want to support us further, swing on over to Angry Snowboarder VIP and become a member. Sure, I could tell you more here, but I got a video over there that explains it so much better. As always, I've been your host, Averin Lefebvre, and I'll see you in another video.